Welcome to the first flashlight video introduction. In this tutorial I will show you how to create a very simple banner in flashlight. First of all we click the right top button on the screen and we now have typing the banner name, the domain name of which we'll be hosting the banner, the width, the height of the banner uh, and then duration for each slide in milliseconds, so like 3000 is uh, 3 seconds. Uh, we can also select the auto start option or the loader asset basically properties so like colors, transparencies. After clicking send we will get this message that banner has been created so let's go to the administration panel and yes we've got the new created just created banner on the screen so we've got six basically icons for each of the banner. Uh, let's start with the first one which is showing the current slides. Obviously there is nothing here but we can add the new slides or the add business type of slides. Uh, let's just create the first simple slide for this banner. Uh, first option we can select the background color then we can upload our image uh, for the background. Eventually it should work. After that we can specify the link which will be clickable for each slide and we can also add the description for each slide. Uh, description is basically uh, using the WSWIC editor so everybody who is familiar with WordPress or Joomla should be familiar with the options available. We can also specify the background or and the transparency for that background as well. And the most important thing we can specify the animation type from the banner list from the animation list we can select the peacemaker we can specify duration for each in an animation type of easings I just select the proper one and everything basically what we need so number of pieces depth of asset delay and we can also check how the current properties are resulting in uh, animation. When everything is done I'm just clicking the red button to save the changes. Now we got the pop-up that's allowing us to select other options. We just select create another slide because uh, banner has to have at least two slides to, to working properly. So let just let me do all those things very quickly for a new slide. Let's type some simple link URL. Also you can uh, select for the URL uh, the type for of opening the URL of the new window or the current window. And we can also just edit quickly to show how powerful is our WSWIC editor and how quickly is it is to just change the text on the fly. Let's save the text and we'll see uh, it's not too bad. We also still need to change the background just to get more consistent view of the previous slide. Let's select a different animation type. Uh, let's say call it wind animation. It's kind of unique feature in Flash like that. It has plenty of unique animations to provide for the user. So each of the banner is totally different. Let's save and let's now see all the banner slides. We should now get should get the two created banners and yes, we got them on the screen. We can also drag and drop them if we want to change the order of them. So let's say if one butterfly want to be first, we just click the red button to save the changes. Now it's very easy just to click on preview and show source link and basically there we are. On top of the screen we've got the three lines of the JavaScript that you have to paste on your website and that's pretty much it. On the bottom you've got the live preview of what we just created in two minutes, four minutes. Uh, each banner can be paused, can be play again, and we can go back to the previous slide, we can go back to the next slide. So totally, totally everything is under our control. Uh, thank you for listening and bye-bye.